Anja's hair is everywhere. <laughs> Hi you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Now I've already done my skin prep. Let's get started with the tutorial. I don't know how I got a pimple all of a sudden. So annoying. Okay, so lately I've been using the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer which I've been loving. Now the Mars Primer is said to be a dupe for the e.l.f. Power Grip. I've already done a short comparing both of these primers so you can check that out. This particular primer holds my makeup in place for a really long time. Also, the base products sit really well on this one. Color correct, I'm using my Too Faced Bond This Way Concealer in the shade Warm Sand. If you're around my skin tone, I would highly recommend using this shade. And another pimple right there. Okay, now that I look like this, I'm gonna blend it out. This is that makeup sponge thing that I got from Amazon. The link will be in my haul video. So today, I'll be using the Kiro Daily Dewy Serum Foundation. Making sure I shake it up really well. I'm taking small amounts and then building it up slowly. Oh, the shade, the shade is 03. And it is a perfect match for me. Please ignore the background sound. Ginger is snoring. I'm using my favorite pack brush, which I've blinged up. I just like to put sparkle on everything around me okay anyway so i have a complete review on this product so if you want to check it out you can if you're planning on purchasing this particular foundation there are a few negative points that i have addressed already in that video so check it out all right so next i'm using the maybelline fit me loose powder in the shade 20. it has been a while since i've used this so i thought of using it today As you guys know i have dry skin and i stay away from powders but it's summer so it's fine next i'm using the forever 52 cream blush I have it in the shade 04 and it is a really pretty coral shade. It's like perfect for the summers. I also think it is a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury. I already made a shots on that so you can check it out. It is pigmented so you need to be careful. Now it was a little product but it went a long long way. So I'm just blending it out with my foundation brush. I'm using the e.l.f. eyebrow pencil to fill in my eyebrows. I need to get a new one because I think it's going to expire soon. And next I'm using the e.l.f. transparent eyebrow gel. Starting with eyes, I'm going to use the Pack Eyeshadow Canvas. I love this product. So for today, I'm using the Natasha Denona Bronze Palette. Honestly, this is the only bronze palette that I have, so I had to use this one only. So I took that deep dark brown shade and I placed that close to my lash line. And then I took that warm brown shade and placed that right above it. Lastly, I went with the mustard shade and blended everything out. Alright, I'm going to do the other eye and I'll be right back. Alright, lashes, eyeliner, kajal, everything is done. Let's get on with the lips. So I'm using the Sugar Matte Attack Transfer Proof Lipstick. It is a beautiful warm brown deep dark chocolate shade. It looks so good, not even kidding. Okay, so here now I wanted to tie my hair but I was crunchy and I was not getting anything. So then I gave up. I was like, okay, let's go. Okay, so I got you guys really, 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 really close. Just so that you can see each and everything clearly. Just want to normalize skin texture, lines, wrinkles. It's okay. Okay, so this is how the overall look turned out. I hope you guys found this video helpful in some way. If you like my vibe, if you like what you've seen, then don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you guys super, super soon in my next video. Bye.